Good morning, Bulldogs. Welcome to BHS TV. I am Madison Williams. And I'm Marietta McCurchin. And here are your announcements for today, Wednesday, November 15, 2023. Seniors, your senior class panoramic fo photo is being taken this morning during third period. So hopefully all seniors are on the field for this fun class picture. Are you taking AP Computer Science this year? Then come to the AP Resources Club meeting today, November 15th, at lunch in room 1316 for tips and advice on how to do well in the class and the AP exam. Receive access to a Google Drive of extra resources and ask questions. The fall dance show titled Metamorphosis will be held this weekend, November 17th and 18th at 7 p.m. in the Wolfsome Auditorium. Ask any Unleashed or Advanced Dance member for ticket information. You don't want to miss this first dance show of the year. Hi BHS, this upcoming Friday the Jazz Band will be hosting their annual swing night event at 5.30 in the school library. A delicious dinner and dessert will be provided, accompanied with an hour of jazz music played by your own peers. Tickets for general admission are $45 and tickets for students are $30. You do not want to miss out on this exciting night of jazz. Another way you can support our bands and orchestras is by buying some C's candy using this QR code. This is a perfect holiday gift for friends and families to support to celebrate the holiday season. This fundraiser ends on December 1st, so make sure to order your chocolates in time for the holidays. Remember, all of your support and contribution goes straight to the bands and orchestra program. Hi Bulldogs, I'm Julie Bolonikian. I'm Aline Suna. The Burbank High Speech and Debate Team had their annual fundraiser on November 8th, 2023 in the Wolfson Auditorium. There are debates on religion in America, Kanye versus Taylor Swift, and the legalization of marijuana. Let's take a look at how that went. So, how is it like being on the debate team, and how do you think the debates tonight went overall? Well, I'm relatively new to the debate team, but I've only been here for about two weeks, and already the people here are so amazing and really super intelligent, uh, very passionate about the debates that they pick and whatnot. If you have a passionate opinion you wish to speak about, I highly recommend the debate team. Um, today went great overall. I think I obviously won against the Kanye and Swift debate. Kanye is clearly better. Uh, but yeah, I think it was great. Hi, so we're here with Nina. Okay, so you had the opportunity to sing at tonight's debate. How, do you, how did you prepare for that and how do you think it went? Um, I think it went well and I prepared like um, doing vocal exercises and just like practicing. But I've sang it at a baseball game before, so have some experience. Of course, thank you so much. Hi, what's your name? Cadence Lee. And how do you think today's debates went? I think today's debates went pretty well. Everyone defended their points pretty well, and there was some humor and audience participation involved. And generally, I think everyone did a great job. Okay, who am I here with today? Emily. Nare. So how did you guys prepare for tonight's debate? So we spent all weekend at Nare's house prepping our case. That was so fun. Yeah, I would say a lot of test studying wasted because of this case but you know what it was worth it thank you guys debate against diego because i was able to prove how religion has more of a good net benefit for the people of america about awards you don't want to talk about awards let's talk about influence how has Connie mm -hmm. influenced other like the young generation except for making them like racist against their own race like he is <laughs> Taylor Swift fans in because when you're an icon of an artist, when you're an influential artist, you don't just have one type of fan base. Okay, that's it for speech and debate. BHS Operation Smile is a club representing the international nonprofit organization Operation Smile, which provides free surgeries for children with a cleft lip or palate. The club is doing a fundraiser where donation boxes will be placed in classrooms so students can donate to help children receive free surgeries. Only a few classrooms have the donation box, so if you would like to donate and your class doesn't have one, go to Ms. Beal's room, room 1213, to give your donation. 100% of the donations will go to the nonprofit organization, Operation Smile. Make sure to donate before Monday, November 20th, since donation boxes will be collected on this day. Attention seniors, LA Grad Services will be on campus to take orders on November 29th for cap and gowns. The basic cap, gown, and tassel set cost $65 through the end of the year. There will be a price increase in January, so make sure you order yours now. Are you a B or C grade aver average student? 
BHS Academic Decathlon is searching for students with GPAs under 3.8 to prepare to participate in 10 different events, have the opportunity to compete with other schools, win medals, and be a key player on the decathlon team. Email Jessica Guyon at BurbankUSD.org or visit Ms. Guyon in room 1328 for more information. Attention, BHS students, do you need help with your homework or to study for a test? After school tutoring is available in the library on Mondays and Wednesdays from 3.30 to 4.30 p.m. by CSF members. Hope to see you there. In College and Career Center news, don't forget on Tuesdays, there continues to be a representative from LAVC on campus during lunch and on Wednesdays, a representative from GCC is on campus during lunch. So please take advantage of these great opportunities and find out what these great schools have to offer. There are lots of volunteer opportunities coming up in the next couple weeks. Check out the Career Center Google Classroom for, for details and links to sign up. Roosevelt Elementary School is having their annual Harry Potter Night this Saturday, November 18th, and they need student volunteers. If you volunteer to help, you will earn 5.25 service hours. Details Saturday, November 18th, 4 to 9.15 p.m. Here's how it breaks out. 4 to 5 p.m. is set up. 5 to 8.30 is event help. 8.30 to 9.15 p.m. is cleanup. You must be able to volunteer for the entire 5.25 hours. If you enjoy interacting with enthusiastic elementary school kids, sign up in the Career Center. The Burbank Coordinating Council is having their annual holiday basket food drive and basket program. They need volunteers to help with their upcoming drives for the holiday basket program. Shifts include using their, your award-winning personality outside a supermarket to get people to buy food, which is more fun than it sounds. Sorting food and helping to build the baskets. Students must have an adult accompany them. Sign up for shifts using the Sign Up Genius, available in the Career Center Google Classroom, code ELEQ5ND. Volunteers are also needed for the Burbank Y Service Club, Christmas Tree Lot. It opens November 25th and runs through December 19th. Hours are Monday to Thursday, 12 p.m. to 9 p.m., and Friday through Sunday, 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. To sign up, email Ms. Joyce at L-U-L-U-E-Y-M-A-N-N -N at gmail.com. There will be a short training required prior to volunteering on Saturdays and Sundays from 10 to 2 p.m. CTE dual enrollment. Attention all current CTE dual enrollment students. The fall 2023 withdrawal deadlines for both GCC and LAVC are fast approaching. GCC's is November 21st and LAVC's is November 25th. A withdrawal or W is better than a failing grade on both your high school and college transcripts. If you are considering withdrawing from your college class and need further assistance on how to do so, please go to the Career Center before the GCC and LAVC deadlines. In addition, the CTE dual enrollment for spring classes will start November 27th. There will be a wide variety of classes that all 9th through 12th grade students can choose for, from for this upcoming spring semester. Each of these classes will gain you free, transferable college and high school credits. Also, many cover an, an area of the IGETC, the general ed classes you need to complete in college, and both are CSU and UC transferable. Starting November 27th, the spring 2024 schedule will, will be posted on the CTE site at BurbankUSD slash CTE, as well as in the Career Center, in addition to information on how to start the college enrollment process. Plan on stopping by the Career Center and visiting the CTE st site starting November 27th. Now, now it's time for your ASB update. update. This week is Kindness Week. Each day has its own take on the idea of being kind to others. Today, Wednesday, is Be Kind to Your Teacher's Day. Which of your teachers stands out for you? On this day, dress like your favorite teacher. Thursday is Superhero Day. Think of what a real superhero does. A superhero helps those in need. This is a kindness, so on this day, dress like your su favorite superhero. Friday is Funky Day. Dress to express yourself on this day. This is a day of joy. What a great way to be kind than to spread joy. ASB hopes you will join in and build kindness through school spirit. Lastly, although this is mainly for seniors, everyone is invited to be a part of the big reveal this Friday at lunch, when ASB will be revealing where Grand Night will take place this year. Come out to the quad to be part of the fun. ASB uses the grade level Google Classrooms for announcements and for staying in touch for this school year. Please join your specific grade level class Google Classroom and follow the ASB Instagram page for announcements and information. And that's, and that's it for your ASB update. update. In sports news, BHS Boys Tennis Trials will be held today, Wednesday, November 15th, right after school at the BHS Tennis Courts. Please come dressed in athletic attire 
bring your tennis racket and make sure your physical clearance is completed to be able to participate. And now here's a look at the veterans baseball game that took place last Thursday evening. We want to thank all of our veterans and players who are a part of this great night. Hey Bulldogs, I'm Sayla. I'm Nathan and on Thursday, Burbank High School Baseball had their first ever veterans game and this is how it went. I'd say the biggest thing about today is uh, the game was pretty important, having some community build up with our veterans and tying in not only the players, but having people from the community kind of help out and be a part of our situation. It's a win, not just for us, but for everybody in the community. Thank you to everybody who came to our game. We hit a walk off, actually he did. And uh, yeah, we put on a show for the veterans. So thank you to all our veterans out there. Um, pass it to Dibby. You know, just a great game. The other team came hard, but we came harder, so we ended up taking the win. And, you know, that's how you do it. I think that today was just really important for everyone involved. I'm just so happy that we could put on a show for our veterans, and I'm just so glad that we were able to really put on, put on the gas for today and take out a win for our veterans, you know? Thank you to everybody who came to the game to support our veterans and our baseball team. And that's it for today's sports news. Okay, Bulldogs, that's it for today's BHS TV video announcements. On behalf of the cast and crew of BHS TV, thank you for watching. And always remember, it's, it's great, great to be a Bulldog. Bulldog.